uh, something about if 2K took over EA Sports, would you be, uh, be on the football game? Yeah. And um, I would, because probably probably would have a uh, my player mode, which would probably be pretty sweet. Yeah, I, I, I've never, I was never a huge fan of uh, the 2K football series. I know a lot of people loved him, but I was always mad. Mad was always the best for me, so I would have a problem. If they lost Madden and went to the 2K guys for football, I'd still play them because I'd be the best football game, but I would prefer them to stick with me. Do you Why like NHL? Everyone, what does everyone hate uh, Brett Favre? Because he's. Because he doesn't the go worst away. <laughs> the way he <laughs> dealt with the Green Bay situation was abysmal, and the way he went to the Vikings was even worse. Yeah. I'm not a fan of him. Me neither. Uh, everything before he left Green Bay, he, he was, was great. one of my favorite quarterbacks historically. I mean, he's gutsy and just classy and all-around awesome. Oh, oh the my God. God. What if they're a man for Mahalo? Do you like the Longhorns or the Ducks? I really don't like Texas at all. I lived in Dallas for eight years. Um, so Longhorns, the Sooners, the Aggies, all those teams uh, really annoyed me while I was there. I will say this, though. The, um, the TCU Horn Frogs. Uh, Horned 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 Frogs. Frogs. Yeah, I like them. They were always the, their fans were always nice and cool. Uh, and that was I was there when uh, the Danny Tomlinson was on the team. And, and he were rushed for like 400 yards yeah. that one game. It's ridiculous. He he is awesome. TCU fans are awesome. Also Texas Tech. I find that Texas Tech people tend to be really cool too. And that was the quarterback and who I got there for the sack. Yeah, that's a great way to uh, Convoy Dude382 on Twitter says, at JW Wally, what type of game do you prefer? Uh, do you like buying the normal versions, or do you like the collector's edition or special edition? Um, any chance I get, I love to pick up special editions, because they always have such cool uh, new other things in there. Um, there's a special edition coming out I'm looking forward to for the game Lord of the Rings War in the North. Um, a special edition of that looks exciting as heck. Ah, oh, really? They swap me. Uh, Tyler and D are lagging, so that's why you came here. I'm sorry uh, to hear that. Hopefully, um, that'll get fixed up for you soon. Um, Hacker and Boot Sniffer says Roethlisberger or Roma? I'll let you field that question, Nick. Uh, Roethlisberger, because Tony Romo dated Jessica Simpson, which is just weird. And did you see what just happened? There? I did. That was kind of unfortunate. I wish I would have had an interception on that. I wish I would just had anyone around. Yeah. <laughs> Um, yeah, Roethlisberger and Romo. That's not even a real yeah, um, thing. Like, Romo's horrible. Yeah, and yeah. Roethlisberger is awesome. I actually have a Tony Romo story for you guys. And this actually made me kind of like him a little bit. Um, so I used to work in a movie theater slash restaurant in Dallas um, known as the Studio Movie Grill. And apparently, uh, Tony Romo really liked going to that place because you could watch movies and eat dinner and stuff at the same time. And it was really cool. So one day, uh, he comes in with his agent and his agent's girlfriend. And they're all excited. Like, oh, come on, we're going to see Later, combo dude. Um, and they wanted to see TMNT, the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles movie, yeah. anime movie that came out like four or five yeah, years yeah, yeah. And he's like, I want to see TMNT. I love that movie. Sure, let me see TMNT. And the ticket booth lady was like, oh, I'm sorry, Mr. Romo. We're all sold out for that movie. And he was like, oh, but I love that movie. <laughs> so for me, Tony Romo's a child. A big, silly child. There you go. Uncharted 3 Beast on Twitter says, At JW Wally, can you use NC State, please, please, please? Um, if we play another game, I will give that some serious consideration because you have tweeted me. And I appreciate that. <laughs> what is your favorite sport? Hmm. Hacker and boots. And mm, either lacrosse or football for me. Uh, as someone that played football in high school in Texas, no less, I'm uh, very partial to football. 
I like football a lot. Uh, I am told I'm not the very best at football games, so I should stick to MVC3, Marvel's Capcom 3. Um, to be fair, I am using a team that I want to see lose, so maybe I'm doing it on purpose. I'm also half paying attention so I can follow the chat. So, eh. I'll show you not good at football games. And I have a glitchy controller, I'm just going to say. I mean, look at that. I'm yeah, obviously not doing that on purpose. Come on. Now I've audible and I don't know my play, and I've got four seconds. Sweet. I can't even stop. You want to switch controllers? No, because then you will be glitchy, and I don't... I'll, I'm fine. I'll figure it out. I'll play with this. Manning or Brady? Ooh. Ooh. Yeah. I mean, that's a really tough one. Well, you, you kind of beat around the bush on that question for a while. What I mean, Peyton Manning takes, you know, probably 5-11 and 11 teams with another quarterback and turns them into, you know, 11-5 and five teams. And he's, you know, ridiculous. And Tom Brady has always had a pretty stacked team. But, I mean, I don't know. Like, I guess... I mean, Tom Brady's never really had a bad team, you know? He's always, his team's yeah. always been pretty good. And, I mean, to be fair, the year that he was out, Matt Castle took that same yeah, team to 11 Yeah, exactly, yeah. You take Peyton Manning off of the Colts in yeah, the year, and they'll go 5 and terrible, five. yeah. There it goes again. How do I have 26 points? Where? What is that? You had a safety. Oh, yeah, I do have a safety. Oh, which Manning? Um, uh, not, not Eli. Not Eli. Not that poor brother. I mean, listen, I love the Mannings. Like, their whole family, they are royalty for New Orleans, and that's where I'm from. Like, that whole family can be wrong. I love them. They're fantastic. Um, so, I'm an Eli fan, I'm a, I'm a Peyton fan, Heck, I'm even a Cooper Manning fan. He's the other brother, right, that got injured and couldn't... Yeah, yeah. he was a wide receiver, I think. So and, so he could have been potentially an NFL wide receiver, too. Like he's, he was right size, good yeah. talent. Um, uh, my thoughts on Mass Effect 3. Um, it's a game that's coming out. It got pushed back. I'd never played the first Mass Effect, so... Uh, somebody really wanted you to answer that question about... Oh, uh, Edwin's cool live stream for Backbreaker? Oh, um, we, uh, we might do that. Uh, not right now. Um, oh, yes. no. Interception. Did I, am I on the one or did I get in the end? No, nah, I think you're on the one. Oh, another thing I hate about this game, when you throw an interception and you're running and your guy catches it on the run yeah. and they tackle him in the end zone, it should be, you know, f you know, uh, motion, like running. It's like there's a rule, like, uh, you know, if, like if, you're, if your foot's already, at, like, going that way, it's not like a... I don't know, what's the word for it? Nah, whatever. But in this game, it's a safety, which is ridiculous. That was a 97-yard touchdown. Just saying. Just saying. Um, Hacker and Boot Sniffer says, is answering our questions fun or entertaining? I don't know. You're the one that has to answer that. I enjoy answering your questions. I enjoy talking to you guys. Are you uh, entertained? Are you having fun? Let me know. Are you not entertained? Are you not entertained? Says Krell, the Magnificent. And the quarterback stays on the 49ers or Raiders? Uh, 49ers. 49ers. I don't hate the Raiders, but uh, I don't know. They're just the Raiders. Yeah, it's, it's kill five enemies with one attack. South Carolina lines up for the kickoff. He just looks straight up. Sends his ball low to the ground. Shout out to Sandy1241. Again, I think. People want shout outs all the time. I have no problem. What would be your guys' personal hell? Like, no coke, no football, no women? Hmm. Yeah, I don't think. It, we'll come over to this. I'd group. say no be. entertainment, like shot. movies or TV or anything like that. Right that would be here, boring. And I'll I don't know how people in olden days do. Uh oh. Oh, Christ. 
Oh, look at that. Coming back. You just keep throwing them interceptions. And I'll just keep making them touchdowns. Texans or Dolphins? I'm going to have to go with Texans on that one. Who did the Texans get in the... They got somebody good, the Texans. Um, yeah, they did. I don't know. It's somebody like... If you know who the Texans picked up, that's good. Uh, I know they got somebody good. I remember reading it. Oh, maybe a cornerback or something. He's already thrown for three scores. Defense better make some adjustments. And they need Hacker and Boot Sniffer said, I just favored it and liked this video. Wally. Go Wally and Nick. Go you, Hacker and Boot Sniffer. <laughs> also, I'm catching up. Boom. Cowboys or Texans? Texans? Texans, obviously. Who likes the Cowboys? the Cowboys? If you like the Cowboys, you're a weird and horrible person. Uh, DT Helsing on uh, Twitter says, at JW Wally, epic stream, uh, but you don't want to don't say, bye to, say bye to me. Uh, are you leaving? <laughs> oh, Jonathan Joseph. Thank you, Gibson. Jonathan Joseph. Yes. Yes. Jonathan Joseph. Yes. I think he was on the Bengals, maybe? Jonathan Joseph? No, maybe... Oh. All right, so one touchdown game. Texans suck. NFL Wolf. and NBA gets a shout out. And the Texans aren't great, but they are better than the Cowboys. I don't like the Cowboys. I don't know if that's obvious. Texan ain't never made the playoffs before. It's true. They haven't. Ain't never made the playoffs before. Uh, I'm not a fan of the Broncos, but I don't hate the Broncos. They're just sort of there. Avatar yeah. Dude says Colts or Saints. That's an easy one. It's all about the Saints. Um, Yeah, I'd say Saints on that one. Yeah. Broncos are cool, too. I like Tim Tebow. I do like Tim Tebow. Uh, really? Uh, he, he's just a good, uh, he's a good spirit. I don't know. I mean, I, what I like about... Oh, that was almost three or seven yeah. in a row. Uh, what I like about Tebow is his... Um, his yeah, I mean, his, his op optimism, his yeah. upbeatness. He's just like a nice guy. I mean, he seems like a guy that was legitimately told he could never do stuff and he put people wrong. That's admirable. I like that about him. Um, he played for the Gators, and I don't like him. <laughs> he... Single-handedly kept uh, LSU out of a national championship game in one year, and that's difficult to take. I don't like him. Right? <laughs> He's mean. And for some reason, my oh, what? I don't know why, but my right defensive end got glitched all the way back there. But when he came running back, he got in the way. Uh, Saints or Steelers? Good question, because this brings up a very important topic. Uh, the Steelers are not black and gold. The Steelers are black and mustard yellow. The Saints are black and gold. Gold is a shimmery, shiny color. The thing that the Steelers use is just straight highlighter yellow. Mustard yellow. Just get that right, Steelers fans. You're not black and gold. First down, 10 yards. Two if Chicago started their third stringer against you, do you think they would have won? I guess that's a Saints question or something? I don't understand the question, Fishman. Please elaborate. Uh, Dolce Gabbana is going to bed. Good night, Dolce Gabbana. <laughs> Hacker and Bootsniffer is uh, going to go play some Madden. We've inspired him. Nice. Uh, so he said bye. Later, uh, Bootsniffer. He's looking to pass. Oh, good stop. Good stop. Maybe a yard on that complaint. And it is cool. Shout out. He's trying to get the ball into the hands of the halfback here. And he did a pretty good job of getting a few yards. But the defense was just swarming to the ball. Sorry, uh, shoot, kill, repeat. Did not mean to uh, miss your buys. So I'm saying bye right now. Play within 15 minutes. That's Appreciate your awesomeness. Ball on the 30 yard line. There we go. Oh. How is Jordan Shipley? Ooh, I do not like Jordan Shipley very much. Really? Really? I just don't like. I don't know. I just don't like the guy. Weird. I you mean, like Tebow, but you don't like Jordan. Yeah, Shipley. I don't know. I don't know. I just never liked him. I like Shipley. I, I, I like the cut of his jib. <laughs> <laughs> he's 
He's um he's on the Bengals. I don't like him because he's on the Bengals, and I just don't like the Bengals. I don't know. Like, listen, the Bengals are punks. And he's on Texas, and I don't like Texas don't except like for Texas. Oh, Vigne- except for Vince Because yeah. he's a hero. <laughs> Shipley's a hero. Jordan Shipley played for UT. Yes, he did. Nick Hayes, uh, quoting in sync. Bye bye bye. Oh come Ooh. on! I can use another pick. Yes, Jordan Shipley played for UT. Um, one of the best receivers they had. Like he, his ability he was good. to he was catch good. Uh, some clutch balls was just—it was difficult to watch as someone that isn't a fan of UT. Shoot, kill, repeat. Shout out from Wally before I go to bed because he's a. Oh, shout out to me. Hmm. Ooh, timeout, 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 timeout. Oh, I called timeout. Oh, oh, you didn't get it. Jesus. <laughs> Saves me three points. 